What's going on? Welcome to another mail day video. Today I received two packages from Japan. We're going to tear these both open and I'm going to show you what I picked up. So let's get to the unboxing. What's going on? All right, so we got this giant box from Japan. This box is a mixture of different things. So whether it's from Amazon Japan or Toys R Us Japan or even Big Camera, uh, I used a shipping company called Tenso to have them all arrive in their warehouse. And once you know I build up a good amount of product, then I have them send it over in one giant package. So we're going to open this up. We're going to see what's inside and we are going to find out uh, if this purchase was worth it. Is it worth it buying it overseas and then having it shipped over or just paying the extraordinary prices here at my local hobby shop. So I'm super excited. Let's check this out. I'm so glad it arrived. It arrived a day early than expected, which is really great. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, slice this open. Yeah, I mean, this is probably, probably my uh, fourth time ordering from uh, Japan. And Tenso has been really great. The prices are very reasonable. Um, instead of paying like a 2X premium on Beyblade stuff or Pokemon stuff, just Buy it through the Japanese website. They provide you a uh, Japanese address and phone numbers so you can place orders online and then just have it shipped over. All right, so, oh, I love this. Let's see. <laughs> We're running out of space. All right, so inside we have some paper packaged very well. You'll see we got some, we got some Amazon Japan slipping, packing slips. Address is on there, you can't share that. But we got the Beyblade X. This is BX20 with Drawn Dagger deck set. That is super cool. Wow, I'm so happy to finally have this in hand. Can't wait to try it out. We got that. We got Beyblade X BX21 with Hell's Chain. This is a really awesome new release from Beyblade. Um, yeah, I mean, this came out about a week and a half ago and we got it here in Canada in about a week and a half. So that's pretty good. And finally, the new booster, which is Beyblade X BX19 Rhino Horn. This one, I'm really excited to try. I'm, try I'm excited to try this with like a low flat bit. Um, I heard that's a really good combination, so that's really cool. It's also very small, so I can't wait to, uh, to open that and see what that's like. And last but not least, whew, hold on, I'm going to have to take all this out first. One sec. We have a new stadium. This is DX10, and this is the special dash stadium to use when playing. That is really cool. I have the uh, clear stadium from the dash set, uh, but I wanted the white one because the white one doesn't show scratches as easily as the clear one does. The black one really shows scratches, so I didn't want to get that. Um, but this one's really great. I'm going to uh, swap out the color of the ring, so I have black and green. I think that would be a really cool combination. But it's always good to just have a second stadium uh, just in case. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty awesome. So let's recap and see what we got. We got the Beyblade X Stadium. We got Rhino Horn BX19. We got the Hell's Chain deck set BX21. And we got the Drawn Dagger deck set BX20. I would say this is a pretty good haul. If you live in Canada, you'll find out that um, these go for almost $80 at uh, hobby shops. In Japan, if you convert it directly, these are about $39, so almost double the price here. Um, with everything combined, this alone to ship from Tenso would have been 30 bucks, but because I combined this, 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 and this, it came out to an, a simple $40 shipping fee, which basically allowed me to save more than half of what I would have otherwise paid if I bought it here 
in Canada. So I'm really excited to get into these. Um, be sure to follow my channel. Um, I'm, I'll be posting the opening videos of these deck sets as well as Rhino Horn and battling it out with all my Beyblades and see, you know, kind of what my first thoughts are. Um, some combos that I think work great or don't work great. But um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy this content, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Uh, don't forget to hit that like button and let me know in the comments. Did you pick one of these up? Do you want to pick one of these up? Which ones are your favorite? With that, I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.